Hello everyone, it is time for my weekly recap video. First of all, I want to say that this will be the last video I do only in English, so from next week you have uh, the right to choose from both Bulgarian or English, dependent on which you prefer. Uh, in this video I would like to check uh, the trading plan and how it developed, uh, the one I shared with you uh, last week. I also want to check the life signal I shared with you and how it developed. So without further ado, let's get to it. First of all, what you can see on the screen, this is uh, the trading plan on the Euro USD currency pair, which I posted uh, last uh, Monday. Actually, it was Tuesday. Uh, let's see what happened with it. So the idea was uh, to look for a possible correction wave from this support area back up to this H4 correction stoppage zone. And of course to look for buy opportunities in this area. As you can see uh, the price moved a little further down after the plan was posted, uh, stayed there for a while and then made uh, the correction. Unfortunately uh, the correction didn't reach all the way up to the H4 correction stoppage zone but uh, it still gave us the opportunity for a few pips. So on this plan I managed to update you with a live signal on our Twitter profile which we are going to check and discuss now. Uh, this is the posting for the live signal as you can see uh, I entered here on this huge candle which engulfed the previous few candles and the stop loss was placed just below the previous bottom. Uh, my expectations were for the price to go and reach the H4 correction stoppage zone. Uh, let's see how it developed on the graph itself. Uh, we can see here that our entry was exactly here on this candle. Sorry I moved a little bit. And after that the price retraced back a little bit but it didn't hit our stop loss which was somewhere here. And then the price moved up in our direction all the way to here. Uh, I didn't update you with a closing sign uh, because I couldn't. I was not on my computer at the time. But uh, if you manage to close some percentage or your whole position here, it was good. Not only because after that we saw a huge drop in the price, which hit our stop loss, but also this uh, level aligns perfectly with a previous bottom where and also a previous small top where we saw uh, the price to react. So here it went all the way from up here, reacted on this level, broke it, couldn't uh, go above it again and then moved further down. So this was a good spot to close at least 70 or 80 percent and put your stop loss at, at break even and just hope for the best for you to for the price to cover uh, the area that is left. Uh, what I also I want to check, uh, I updated you with uh, two tips on our Twitter page as well. Uh, one was uh, to check out the CAD Japanese Yen and a possible uptrend wave there. So let's see what happened. This is the H4 chart. You can see uh, my tip was posted on this candle. It was green at the time when the tip was posted. And uh, the point was that, oops, the point was that at this candle, um, the pair was touching the 200 MA. I'm gonna turn that on so you can see it here. And my expectations were for an uptrend up to the 85 uh, level, so somewhere around here. As you can see, the price reached. Its ultimate high was at the 86 level, so 
if you followed up on that tip and managed to buy somewhere down here, you could have made around 100 pips in profit. The other tip was about the Euro Robo. Uh, this is again the H4 chart. And I tipped you that the Euro Robo just broke a important support level, which for me was here. And my expectations for it were for the price to drop down probably to somewhere here. <clears throat> Uh, the price of 71 to 70 something like that uh, here we had the break I'm just gonna turn that blue as you can see um, after the break we had a small consolidation the price retraced back to this broken level and it seems that it bounced from it so I expect for the price uh, to continue down and reach probably the 71 level or even the 70 level. So there is still chance for you to enter. That would be all from me for this week. Uh, thank you very much uh, for your attention. I hope you managed to make some profits and uh, keep following us this week for more profits. Thank you.